he, as a county, inherited um, finances that were steeped in debt. Tulikuwa na madeni mingi. After the previous design of the headquarters tended to be built here was never built. <coughs> the design and all those contractual obligations, we inherited a debt of 94 million for something that was never constructed. We are still grappling with how to pay those debts because those who took the matter to court and those who were supposed to defend the county did not defend the county. So we conceded, and this county I can report to you with confidence, uh, we owe about 94 million kwa kazi ile ilikuwa hewa. Kazi hewa. Designed, uh, started, and it is not there. Have you seen any headquarters that is worth paying for 94 million? Nyinyi mmeyona? Nadeni iko hapo tulipata hapo. And since it involves the court, uh, we will have to arrange uh, how to pay it. Tuko na madeni mingi, na tunajaribu kulipa, lakini kuna zingine very difficult to handle, but because we believe in the rule of law, we will see how to sort them out. Over 34 million shillings was sunk there. Have you seen the speaker's residence? It's not there. So wale wana tembea huku wakisema, ati ni raisi kuwa governor na unochilo anafanya bure, they do not know the kind of problems we inherited. Those are very serious problems because kuna mambo ina takikana ifanywe hapa na kuna madeni unaitajika kulipa and for things that never took place. So those are the challenges we have. But sisi, kwa sababu watutaki kuangalia nyuma, we are driving using the front and not looking at the rear mirror or the side mirror. Kwa hivi atutaki kwa laumu, lakini we want to stand on the path of truth and commit that we'll have uh, proper offices by uh, the end of about two years from now.